up, cybernauts. Prepare to witness a Tesla Cybertruck defy gravity, physics, and maybe even common sense as we plunge headfirst into its newly revealed aquatic playground, Wade Mode. Oh, forget dull old pavement. We're talking epic river crossings, mud-slinging escapades, and enough splashdown potential to make a mermaid jealous. So ditch the landlubber life and grab your snorkel, because I'm your captain on this wild voyage deep into the heart of Cybertruck's watery secrets. We'll crack the code on how deep this truck can go, how it manages to stay afloat without growing gills, and most importantly, whether you should finally invest in that inflatable flamingo pool float. Because who wouldn't want to cruise down Main Street with a pink feathered friend perched on their electric beast? So hold on to your hats, tighten your swimsuits, and dive into the electrifying world of the Tesla Cybertruck's Wade Mode, where the only limit is your imagination and maybe the occasional rogue wave. This isn't your grandpa's pickup truck, folks. This is the future of amphibious adventure, and we're about to ride the wave. Cybertruck Background Before we plunge into the watery depths of wade mode, let's cast our eyes back to the land where the Cybertruck first kicked up a storm, uh, of dust mostly. Remember that angular alien behemoth that shattered windows and defied expectations at its unveiling? Yeah, that's our amphibious hero. Its stainless steel skin might have sparked memes and debates, but one thing's for sure, this truck isn't afraid to make a statement. Bless his eccentric heart, Elon saw beyond the initial bewilderment and championed its unorthodox design, touting its off-road prowess and futuristic features. And boy, did it deliver. Test runs proved it could conquer steep inclines and crawl through treacherous terrain with the best of them, leaving seasoned truck enthusiasts jaws agape and maybe a little envious. Clearly, this wasn't just your average pickup. It was a glimpse into the future of electric adventure, and people were hungry for more. So with anticipation already at a fever pitch, the news of Wade Mode hit like a tidal wave, promising to take the Cybertruck's game to a whole new level. Buckle up, folks because we're about to set sail on a technological odyssey where land meets water and expectations get swept away by the current. The main event. Ahoy, mateys. Time to ditch the dusty plains and dive deep into the watery heart of wade mode. Picture this, your cyber steed poised on the riverbank gleaming in the sunlight. With a tap of the screen, the air suspension inflates transforming the truck into a hulking beast ready to conquer the currents. But how does this magic work? Hold on to your sea hats because we're about to crack the code. The battery pack gets pressurized like a submarine, sealing its fate from the watery abyss. Meanwhile, the suspension stretches skyward, giving you clearance worthy of a cruise ship, minus the buffet, sadly. So just how deep can this monster go? We're talking depths that make the Rivian and Ford F-150 Raptor blush. Think wading through a flooded street with a smug grin, conquering muddy trails with a splash, and maybe even navigating shallow creeks with your inner crocodile Dundee awakened. But before you picture yourself steering clear of traffic jams by cruising down the Thames, let's be real, there are limitations. Electronics and water don't always play nice, so submerged joyrides are a no-go. Think more adventure-ready than underwater escape pod. Still, Wade Mode opens up a new world of possibilities for the Cybertruck, transforming it from a landlubber to an amphibious adventurer. Imagine quickly navigating flooded campsites, traversing muddy festival grounds without a flinch, or rescuing stranded kayakers with a heroic splash. Remember, Caution is your captain, and common sense is your compass. So while wade mode lets you flirt with the watery edge, don't push your luck, unless you enjoy explaining a soggy interior and a grumpy Elon Musk to your insurance company. Now let's set sail into a world where Cybertrucks conquer rivers, mudsling with glee, and redefine the meaning of off-roading. Because buckle up folks, wade mode is here to stay. And the only thing more profound than its capabilities is the thrill of the ride. More Cybertruck goodies. 
While Wade Mode has stolen the spotlight, it's not the only gem the Cybertruck unearthed in its recent update. Hold on to your hats, Cybernauts, because the future of electric adventure just got even brighter. Let's jump on the autopilot bandwagon, shall we? The latest software upgrades promise smoother sailing on the open road, with improved lane changing prowess and obstacle avoidance that would make a dolphin jealous. Feeling like a minimalist nomad? Check out the sleek new modular cargo options, transforming your Cybertruck into a mobile home, artist studio, spontaneous camping haven, the possibilities are as endless as the road ahead. And wouldn't it be a true Tesla unveil without a hidden Easter egg or two? Keep your eyes peeled for playful software tweaks and design details that will have you grinning like a secret society member. But the real excitement lies in what's to come. Whispers swirl around future upgrades that could make the Cybertruck a true water warrior. Think retractable snorkels, amphibious tires, and maybe even a built-in kayak launcher. Because why not? With Wade Mode opening the floodgates of possibility, it's clear that the Cybertruck's evolution is just beginning. This truck isn't just a vehicle, it's a blank canvas for adventure, and Elon Musk's paintbrush is just getting warmed up. So what does this mean for the Cybertruck's future? Well, prepare for a wave of interest flooding the market. Wade Mode can potentially lure in a whole new audience, folks who crave adventure beyond the asphalt jungle. Imagine weekend warriors traversing backcountry creeks, nature enthusiasts setting up camp next to secluded waterfalls, and maybe even preppers feeling much more secure with their amphibious escape pod. Sure, it might not be everyone's cup of tea, but for those who thirst for the unconventional, the Cybertruck with its newfound aquatic prowess is the next big thing on wheels, or maybe fins. So keep your eyes on the horizon, folks, because the Cybertruck's journey is just beginning. And with Wade Mode propelling it forward, the only thing wilder than the ride is what lies ahead. All right, landlubbers and future merfolk, we've splashed around in the shallows, probed the depths of Wade Mode, and emerge with gills tingling and imaginations running wild. So before you dry off and return to your landlocked lives, let's take a final dip in the pool of possibilities. Did Wade Mode leave you yearning for watery escapades? Or are you content cruising on dry land? Share your thoughts, theories, and wildest Cybertruck dreams in the comments below. Let's turn this blog post into a tidal wave of discussion. And while you're at it, hit that subscribe button like a seagull diving for fries, smash that like button like a rogue wave against a breakwater, and share this aquatic adventure with your fellow Cybernauts. Remember, the future of experience isn't paved, it's flooded. And with the Cybertruck leading the charge, we're all aboard the wildest electric voyage ever conceived. So buckle up, charge your batteries, and get ready to pre-order your amphibious beast because the open water awaits. The only thing more profound than the Cybertruck's capabilities is the thrill of owning one. Now, excuse me while I practice my mermaid laugh. It will come in handy when cruising down Main Street in my Cybertruck pool floating firmly in place. <laughs>